Welcome back to day 7 of random math stuff. Put yourself in my shoes. You make a math video and somewhere in the middle you mention a convex polygon. Now, 10% of your audience doesn't know what that is. 10% isn't that much, but it's enough for you to justify taking time out of the video to explain what that means. So how on earth do you do that? You need something intuitive, simple, and fast. You might say, every interior angle in this polygon must be less than 180 degrees. And you might think, sounds simple enough. But you have to keep in mind, those 10% of people aren't really interested in math, and they're definitely not as familiar with angles as you are. It will take them a lot longer than you think to process exactly what that means. This isn't really intuitive, simple, or fast for them, and your job is to get them interested in math, which you just failed at. So you might go for something more intuitive. All the vertices point outwards, away from the shape itself. Now this would be a great definition if it were not for the existence of the star shape, which is not convex. And I guarantee you, if you walk up to a random person in the street and ask them to think of a shape with all vertices pointing outwards, the first thing their brain comes up with will be a star. They heard outwards pointing vertices, and a star is by far and away the most obvious shape to illustrate that. An octagon doesn't convey the same feeling of pointing outwards that the star does. Okay, how about we give some examples instead of a definition? This shape is convex, but this shape is concave, because it's got a cave. If it doesn't have a cave, it's convex. And you might give some more examples, because it's not really clear what a cave implies. Is this a cave? Do these count as caves? You see the problem already, it's not really rigorous and takes some time to explain, time that the other 90% of your viewers are sleeping through. But it's good enough, so for a while I just went with this definition whenever I had to explain what a convex polygon was. And sometimes I would skip the definition altogether when I felt that the rest of the video's contents were more advanced than usual. But now I have the solution to this problem. A shape is convex if a rubber band wraps around it snugly. It's amazing! It checks all three boxes! What if I wanted to find a convex hull? It's the shape of the rubber band. That would have taken so much longer to explain without this. You don't understand how much trouble I've been saved. Anyway, that's all I have for you today. Oh, one more thing. Guess the graph website is here for you to play around with, but I don't like coding so I'm dropping the project here. And if you want more, here are a couple websites made by viewers. Anyway, I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Peace.